All right, guys. <clears throat> we're going to be spooling up this MXL G2 single speed. What we're going to go ahead and do is do the first 50 yards and 65 in red. So that way we can give him a, uh, a warning segment. So that way he knows if he's running out of line while fighting a big fish. So that's why we've been doing that on the channel. If y'all are new to the channel, it is something different, you know, to offer our customers. And doing the anaconda knot to the spool, guys. We finally named our knot. Yeah. Gotta buy it. Gotta buy it. Got a lot of stress on my mind It's a nice day to go Yeah, I got a line I'm a caller The whole team Something we should have did a long time ago it Probably would have made the videos go viral that way <laughs> we didn't, didn't catch on, but we're here now So what are you studying for? Uh, aviation maintenance Oh, okay Oh, you're going to be an aircraft mechanic? Mm -hmm. Oh, damn How much longer you got? graduated May. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Like, I would have been here sooner, but I was, uh, when I was talking with the, the guys there, uh, some people called me from some contracting places. Already? I submitted my resume. Awesome. So you're trying to get a job like here in Anaheim Corpus Christi or Kingsville? Uh, I mean, really anywhere. Mm -hmm. I actually was an aircraft mechanic here in NAS Corpus Christi. Oh, yeah, seven and a half years. Yeah, it was a diesel mechanic for the T-34s, which they don't even have anymore. <laughs> we had CDI for the P-34s when I was there, so aircraft mechanic too. Oh shoot, I got all sidetracked. I'm going to have to download and reload it so that I can get you that 50. I'm already at 165. Whoops. thing about doing that is I got no line counter coming off this way so I have to go all the way back and start all over. My fault. Just glad I caught it here instead of 300 yards. <laughs> so how long you been going to school for aircraft and half? People drop out, don't ever make it back, man. Yeah. So that's good. All right. All right, started the line counter over. Let's try this again. All right. 
Here we go, guys. <laughs> I gotta stop at 50 yards. <laughs> Mental note. <coughs> <coughs> yards of the 65 on here so that way uh, he can know that he's got 300 yards still once he gets his top shot on Yeah, those last several reels that had monofilament, they were from that other shop that got spoiled like that. Or it popped off when I was downloading. Oh. It's like, wow. Hmm. Chinese finger trap. Uh, yeah, the harder you pull, the tighter it gets. Now, what color top shot would you like? Got red, white, and blue. Got dark blue. Got white. Got chartreuse. Red, white, blue. Red, white, blue. Nice. There we go. Kind of rod you're putting it on? Uh, no, we stick. Uh, two piece, one piece? Uh, two piece. Ten foot? Ten foot, uh, extra heavy. Okay. And you know about wetting the line before every first cast, oh, right? Yeah, no, I've learned my lesson. Okay.
<clears throat> the one thing I do like about salt water though on, on the line is it don't dry easily. So yeah, it stays right. Actually, I got more braid on there. I'm at 433 yards. Just bought this reel. You see those four little scratches on it? There's uh, little scratches that I noticed when I was about to take the reel off the uh, spooler machine and I showed the customer. It's brand new reel too.